I'm Dr. John Scharfenberg, a medical physician, uh, professor of nutrition at the Loma Linda University in Loma Linda, California. And today I wish to discuss with you the foods that increase cancer risk. What kind of foods are they? Mainly, they're the animal foods, mostly meat, for example. Meat eaten once a week increases the risk of colon cancer by two and a half times. So that kind of food, particularly processed meats, are bad. The World Cancer Research Fund in London revealed all the scientific studies on foods to see which cause the most cancers. They recommend don't ever eat processed meats. That is meats which are sal salted, smoked, uh, added chemicals as nitrates. Uh, these all help to cause intestinal cancer. These meats are primarily pork and ham. Now, prostate cancer risk is increased 3.8 times if we're eating a lot of uh, meat, milk, eggs, and cheese. A vegetarian diet would help to decrease the risk. Meat users are more apt to be overweight. They're two to two and a half times at greater risk of being obese. And that obesity itself increases cancer risk. Now, if you cook meat, and you have to cook it to destroy the germs that are in it, the bacteria, the salmonella, and such foods, you have to cook it. But if you overcook it and you cook it well, there's some genetic type women where it will increase their risk of breast cancer eightfold. Ovary risk is increased greatly by the amount of cholesterol in the diet. And of course, all animal foods have cholesterol. Eggs have the most. One egg a day increased the risk of ovary cancer by 42%. Eggs also increased the risk of colon cancer. That's because of the cholesterol in the eggs. There are another type of food which increase the risk. Irritating spices, such as black pepper and chili pepper, increases the risk of esophageal and stomach cancer. They have a carcinogenic substance in them. Now, how can you tell if it's irritating spice? If it's cold to the finger, but hot to the tongue, you know it's an irritating spice. Now, there are a few other foods, like... Peanuts, if they have aflatoxin, they will increase cancer risk. That's a mold. And that's because the peanuts, the peanuts were not harvested soon enough. They weren't harvested properly, but left out in the, in the field to develop a mold. But in general, the plant foods reduce the risk of cancer, and the animal foods increase the risk. What about milk? Milk actually lowers colon cancer risk and lowers a lot of cancers, esophageal, stomach, and such. But it does, because of the calcium, increase slightly the prostate cancer risk. But in general, a vegetarian diet is the way to go to decrease your risk of cancer.